That's right, it happened down this road and then traveled over into this large field beside me. Officers say that it all started with a person driving a large piece of machinery and causing damage to the area. They say officers arrived around four this morning on the 100 block of Schultz Drive in Huntington after reports of a disturbance. They say it led to a lengthy pursuit between a man driving what they call a backhoe style machine and officers in vehicles and on foot. I talked with Sergeant Brian Walker from the Indiana State Police. He tells me there was an exchange in gunfire, which led to one officer from the Huntington Police Department being shot and sent to the hospital in serious condition, and the suspect was pronounced dead on the scene. You, you try and contain and, and control these events as much as you can, but um, things happen that sometimes are beyond the officer's control, and, and it's just what we deal with as law enforcement. I'm raising an autistic son. So I'm very concerned about this area. I had a feeling something bad was going to go down eventually. I also talked with Dennis Houston, who lives across the street from the scene. He says there have been incidents like this before in this area, and it made him worried for his safety and the safety of his son. Police say the pursuit also led to some damage of a nearby middle school. If you take a look behind me, you can see that this fence was knocked down. Um, there's some marks in the grass from the driving but they say they are unsure what led to the disturbance. Police say they will keep this incident under investigation. For now, Carly Van Cleve, Fort Wayne's NBC.